It's Friday. Hello, everyone. Sorry, I'm a little late. Been a little late for everything today. <laughs> hello, hello. Oh, hello, everyone. Welcome. Hello, Miss Holly. It's Friday. It's the end of the week. It has been absolutely chaos today. Chaos. I am. Hello, Miss Linda. Hello again, Miss Kathy. I see you finished your towel, Miss Rochelle. Oh my goodness. It's the first time I've sat down all day. Hello, <laughs> Miss Crystal. I have like 90,000 things that all need to be done. I taught, um, we spent today in the classroom. Hello, Miss Sharon, Miss Nicole, Miss Jessica, Miss Darlene. Um, today was Spoonful of Sunshine with Kimberbell. So we worked on aprons and towels and towel hangers today. And then I wrapped that class up this afternoon here and then quickly went running to try to get everything together for live. Didn't quite get everything finished, but that's okay. Um, you'll just, you'll know that it'll eventually be up online here. As soon as I wrap up live, I got to run and get ready for our first virtual meet and greet or meet up for Queen of Diamonds tonight. So yeah, exciting. We have lots of, lots of things going on. And then I got to come back and finish cleaning up from today and get ready for tomorrow's Spoonful of Sunshine. So lots and lots and lots of things going on. How was everyone's week? Did everybody have a good week? Hello, Miss Sharon. It's beautiful outside. At least for the moment I stepped outside to walk down the sidewalk <laughs> and then quickly come back because FedEx felt the need to deliver my packages to another building today. Hello, Miss Linda, Miss Pam, Miss Becky. Welcome. Hello, everybody. Hi, Miss Miriam. Hi, Miss Caroline. I emailed you um, a response. I am going to talk about it here in just a moment. So, yes, we will chat. Oh, it's okay, Miss Lisa. Wasn't too bad. I, I handled it. It was only six people, so we were good. I'm glad it wasn't more than that today. So, I am. Um, I'm glad I limited it. <laughs> Hello from Miss Oregon. Hello, Miss Stephanie. Visiting mommy. Hi, mommy. <laughs> yes, we are going to talk. We will talk about Wanderlane as well here the, today. Um, yes, exciting. Well, we're going to jump right in to everything that's going on because I have um, lots of things going on and I want to be able to cover everything that I have here for you today. if I can get a drink of water. I didn't even have time to write my own list. I had to print the link list that we use. <laughs> I was like, oh, I'm just gonna print it, not gonna sit and write it. So a couple of things that launched this week. Uh, the Wander Lane Block of the Month registration is up for registration. We'll talk about it here in just a few moments. And then we have the Retreat Yourself weekend details came out. So the weekend details, this is for November, our November retreat. Uh, Miss Tina worked hard today to get our retreat page up. So you can find all the details will be on the link that you will get down here. Um, or you can uh, pop up, uh, up on social media. It's pinned to the top of the Facebook page um, here where you are at watching live but everything is there. You haven't missed anything. We have not launched registration yet. This was just a release of dates and times. Well, not really times, dates and money. Um, and the date we will be uh, November 8th through the 12th. It's a Wednesday through a Sunday. Um, and we it'll be Wednesday after lunch through Sunday after lunch. And we will open registration on June 1st at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. 
This allows my working gals to be able to be home, hopefully from work by that time, and allows me to have my day wrapped up so that I can make sure that everything is working on the back end and we don't break the internet uh, with registration. <laughs> so it's always fun um, to see that. So all that information is up here. The link is there. Uh, for retreat information. If you have any questions, please feel free to email or call or text us uh, and we'll gladly answer them for you. All right. Anybody who pre-ordered the Kimberbell Cuties Volume 2 book, just the book, the fabric's not all here yet, the books will be arriving um, next week. And I will also have, if you pre-ordered kits, the two kits that we do have ready um, will be uh, available for you as well um, once the book arrives. So we'll have all that. It's coming. Um, that was that. The new designs from OBSD that launched today um, is all kind of baby themed. Okay, we have the Winnie the Pooh collection that launched uh, up online today, as well as I have a couple physical copies in store, but if you wanted to do the download, uh, that's there. So I'm gonna walk over here. So Winnie the Pooh, okay, is there um, now up and available. We also have launching this week is going to be the Simply Blessed collection from Martha Pullen or Rocks of Rockstar Sewing. Now it's all blue work, or you can make it red work, or you can make it pink work. Um, completely your choice <laughs> of uh, baby designs. And then the last collection that released this week that is up for download only is the Baby Month Appliques. So the link that we just put here um, will take you to the What's New section as well as all the collections are on sale up online for digital download. Okay, so just the digital downloads are on sale um, this week for you. And it's only through today through, I think usually it's Thursday um, before they change out and put up the next week's um, releases. So if those are interested to you, please be sure to check the link here or you can visit OESD Get to the Embroidery Online website through our webpage. Um, it would be greatly appreciated. All right, let me just make some checks here um, so I don't forget things. We had, oh, let's see, some restocks that arrived um, this week. One, we got one bolt of grunge. <laughs> in this week. I really need to put some more water in that cup. <laughs> Just chewing ice now. Um, our famous or infamous or most popular uh, gray paper has arrived. So gray paper is back in stock as well as vanilla and natural. So we are slowly getting there. They are, um, we have lots on order. It is a struggle bus for Moda and Grunge right now. They are um, kind of, again, what you need, Mom? Supply chain um, problem. So not really supply chain, it's just, you can ask a question. You can't, okay, give me one second. Mom's having some technical difficulty. Just turn the volume down for me so it doesn't echo. One second. <laughs> Mom's having technical difficulty. Okay, what do you need? One second. One second, please. One second, please. You should just be able to hit enter on okay. the keyboard and it'll go in. Just hit enter. Is it, yeah. is it doing what it's doing? Okay. While I'm back here, let me just talk about something. So, one second, let's turn the volume down so you don't hear me. <laughs> we have a couple of things that we restocked. 
Um, in addition to uh, what I said earlier, 14 inch square rotating mats from Creative Grids are back in stock. We talked about these last Friday and they all went out the door. So they're back in stock this Friday for you as well. Go under, oh, I may not have put it there. So mom will, mom will pull a link. If you just go to the website and click on, just type in the word rotating. Um, I obviously missed a link in all of my prep work. I'm gonna set you down here for a moment. Um, so the 14 inch square rotating mat, mat from Creative Grids is back in stock. The other thing that came in this week, I'm just gonna roll you. Look at that, if I'm rolling my cart. <laughs> Oh, it's been a day, everybody. It's been a day. And now I can't find... Oh, hold on. Let's just come rolling along with me in my very dirty office. I have two remaining 20 spool thread collections from Tula Pink um, are back in stock. I have two remaining... Um, so if you are interested in the Neons and Neutrals 20 spool collection, we have two left. Okay. And we also got the cutest little um, zipper pulls slash charms in today um, or in earlier this week. So I'm going to show you. We have these little right here. This is the Seam Ripper charms. We have the charms with the scissors and the bobbins. We got rotary mats and hand needles, buttons and scissors. We have tape measures and rotary cutters, patterns and the word so cute um, is in there. And I think those are the six designs um, yeah, that you could turn them into earrings. They may be a little big, but you could totally turn them into earrings. <laughs> All right, so that is in. Now, the other thing that has arrived, now my Queen of Diamonds gals, you, um, we have a virtual meetup tonight. Um, it will be recorded. Uh, the links were sent twice. I think I sent them earlier this week. I sent them again this morning and I sent those that just registered this afternoon. You should have your link now. Um, but for everyone else, they're here. So Queen of Diamonds first installment is ready for pickup. Okay. We will be, for those that require shipping, they will be shipped on Monday. Okay. If we do not have payment information on file from you, we will be calling. We will not release for shipping um, for, um, uh, we will not release the kits unless we have um, money on account or money to pay for it. Um, but yes, so I should, for those that were part of the last six, the extra six that I got, um, of those kits, the I have, I think a box arrived today that has your papers and things in it. So we will have those ready shortly, but everything is here. So if you pre-ordered paper, acrylics, it's here, your patterns in the bag, your kit, it's all there. So if you are out and about, you do not need it for the virtual meetup. That is not required. So you can, if you're coming to the in-person meetup, um, if you're coming to the in-person meetup next week, you can get it then. Um, it's not required. The first video for the first block does not launch until June 5th. Okay, so you're not behind. Please do not pay attention to all the chatter and get let that Facebook group create you more chaos. You are just fine. I We're going to work on the Material Girls timeline. Okay. Don't, don't let them get you all anxious. I just shake my head. Just shake my head today. So <laughs> we had a restock. Let's talk about that. Uh, in Twinkle. So Twinkle, if you um, don't know what Twinkle is, Twinkle's from Moda. It is a 
little background with a little itty bitty tiny star. So instead of a polka dot, it's a little tiny star. Okay, so you want to, um, uh, let's see, what colors? Yellow is back in stock, like butter yellow. Purple, a patriotic, which is white with a multicolored star. And it's the silver is um, metallic that's in there. Um, unfortunately, Miss Cindy, my queen of diamonds is sold out. I do not have any kits remaining um, for that program. I'm sorry. Um, it is all gone. Um, and okay, we talked about that. We talked about that. Talked about that. We got in a new crab today. Let's see if I can get it, my hands on it. I don't know, that's pretty realistic. So this is the new all hands on deck realistic crab print. So we've got blue ones and we have the brownish ones um, that are there. So that print is here as well. That just came in. We got in some more of the seasonal celebration um, kind of novelty prints. Um, we got in, hold on one second, I'm just gonna put you on the ground. We have one that's kind of for February, okay? Donuts and cupcakes. This is from Celebrate. These, this one, these coordinate with placemats and wall hangings that we have. We got in two additional colors of the tossed fruit. So there is a yellow background and a purple background of the tossed fruit. We got in an additional leaf with leaves on brown. We also got in the patriotic star on blue as well. So all of these pieces are just, you know, kind of novelty themed, one piece for each month of the year, okay? We also have a panel that will be coming. I didn't, we didn't get it done today. I'm still trying to decide if I'm gonna sell it as one big giant panel or if I'm gonna split it up into months. But this panel, has 12 like little door hangers. They are about 14 by 20. Okay. And there's 12 of them. One for every month. Okay. All themed. And then we have a coordinating piece that um, goes with it. And so that is part of Celebrate 2.0. We have, you may remember last year, we have some of these uh, themed flags from last year. They're different, these are different prints, but they're on a smaller scale than the flag that we had from last year. So these will be ready, kind of like a miniature flag. I think you could totally cut, you know, turn this into like a flag, a mini flag, like a garden flag. Um, um, that's there as well. So that's, um, that will be up online here shortly. Didn't quite happen today. One of the things that did not get done, I didn't think it was, had to stop. I had to stop and go live. Uh, you could put them for doors. They totally could fit on a door. Um, yeah, without a problem. Could be a little door banner, but I have something, oh, I have something even better. I will get myself together. Hopefully we'll talk about it next week for 2024. Just, just saying for 2024. Now, we all love some Tula, right? One little Tula thing that arrived this week. If you've been in the store, you probably saw it. If you dig around the website, you probably found it. And 
108 inch wide. If you follow Tula, she's been talking about it. She's had it. Um, she's had it because obviously it's her fabric. She gets it first. But the 108 inch wide, um, you don't want to see my face. Let's look at this fabric. Extra large. So these prints are prints that are part of her True Colors collection. But these are scaled way bigger. Okay. So you, there are two rainbow hexes. So the hexes grade eight in color. There's one black and white and one on blue. There are two fairy dust pieces. And then we have a white on white in the hexy and a white on white in the fairy dust. This here, this, not fairy dust, fairy flake. No fairy dust. Um, fairy flake is the white on white. This whisper, this gray one, is the suggested backing for Queen of Diamonds. So um, if you were up in the air about it, you can see it in person about this. So it's 108 inches wide and um, super, super soft. Like all the tool of backings are like sateens. So very, very super, super soft. So that is here and ready for you. I had it been here a few days before, I may have gotten it quilted and cut my place for everything out of it, but next one. Next time we will maybe make a bag out of it. I think the scale of it could work well in like a duffel bag. I wouldn't, um... <laughs> you're so funny, Miss Dawn. I wouldn't use it for a smaller bag or smaller pieces, but definitely some of the, the duffels and the things that have larger um, pieces to them. Okay, patterns that have come in. Let me see if they're hanging over here where they belong. The zip up tray is not a new pattern. It's one that we've had, but it is back in stock. Um, and I didn't get a chance to go over and get the zip up tray, but I will um, we'll walk over there and I'll get it. So the zip up tray is back in stock. Great for handwork, EP peers or hand piecers, or um, I could even see like kids, if markers, pencils, things along that lines. And then if you've been in the, the Queen of Diamonds Facebook groups or watching people, uh, Kelly made her booklet pouch. This is the booklet pouch pattern is now here in the store um, for you as well. And this pattern calls for um, separating zippers as well as closed zippers. And we have separating zippers here in Material Girls. Um, for you as well. So those two patterns arrived this week. If you follow Atkinson Designs, she released a new pattern uh, this week called Star Spangled. It has been pre-ordered and will be arriving, and there's that gray hair again, um, and will be arriving as soon as it's released. So uh, what do they hold? The booklet pouch is just a bunch of sewn in pages that are like a Ziploc top or a zippered top. So big enough to hold uh spools of thread you could put pens and pencils and things it's just a a booklet full of pouches it's <laughs> not a better way to, to explain it we'll get one um it it's uh we'll get one made i didn't i didn't get there yet okay the geometric crab if you go back in the mgqb society i know that um Kelly Palmer. Um, oh, there's two sizes. Yes. Yeah, so there is a bigger one that you could use to hold. I think some people are thinking, or did Tula show it like holding her papers, her English paper piecing papers, things like that. Um, I could be out of it again. I will go look. We may have them behind the counter because uh, Miss Crystal, the place for everything pattern because of class, but I'll look. Uh, the geometric foundation paper pieced crab pattern is back in stock uh, for you as well. So that is back here. Checking my list. There's that. I have. Um, yes. Uh, let's see. What else has come this week? Oh, we got some new thread. We have some new fabric. Um, we ready for Christmas fabric? Maybe. Let's talk about thread first. 
we got in a new line of 50 weight cotton thread and oh i just walked over here and there's more stuff here uh the 50 weight cotton thread is a 50 weight three ply it is from wonderfill it is a thousand meter spool and it is oh, all these beautiful colors so this thread is um good for quilting thread painting long arm it's low lint hand piecing machine piecing general sewing so it is a 50 weight cotton three ply um, lots and lots of beautiful colors um, are there so that is now here and up online for you i have not for those that were in a place for everything i have not gotten to posting the recording yet i'm very sorry I will do that as soon as I am done here and send you out the link. I have not forgotten. It has just been chaos. Chaos. I don't know which direction to go. Um, now, but I will get it. I will get it. I promise. I'll do it while we're teaching Queen of Diamonds tonight. The other thing that we got in is a uh, little notiony gadgety thing and. Mom, you're probably not going to have a link for it because I just added it. I'm going to pull it out here. If it wants to come out of the bag. It's called a scissor holster. Okay. I was trying to see if... No, they don't have a picture on it. But it's going to stick to the side of whatever surface that you want to stick it to. So if you stick it to the side of your machine, it is designed for you to slide your scissors in to hold them. I don't drop them. So you can always have your scissors right on the side of the machine or in a particular area. There are two size holders that are there. So one for a big pair, one to hold a smaller pair. So the scissor holsters arrived. We have them in red and in blue. Okay, those are the two colors that are available um, as well. Yeah, I, I'm sure that, here's the thing, is that yes, it's gonna keep my scissors where they belong, but I've also gotta put them back where they belong. <laughs> <laughs> gotta put them back. Now, let Miss Amy say hello to her little people because I know there's some little people watching me tonight. So I'm going to say hello first to Miss Ava and Mr. Roland. Um, I'm going to say hello to Grady, Layton, Spencer, Violet. Mimi says hi. Abby, Ian, Emma, Owen, and Luke. I was so excited I got to see Luke and Ian today. We have Sammy, Alexander, Ryder, Cecilia. I have Leah, Smith, Sage, Mary Catherine, John Robert, Daniel, Austin, um, Mackenzie, and Miss Alyssa. So, hello from Miss Amy. I know there have been questions about kids sewing in kids camp for the summer. I'm, I'm getting there. One day I will have it ready before school is out, I promise, one day but it's not gonna be 2023, I will tell you that. <laughs> now, the last thing that I wanna show you, because like I said, it's gonna be a short one tonight because I have a bunch of things to do before I go live. Oh, Miss Aubrey, thank you, Miss Jackie, Aubrey and Camden. And I wanna say happy birthday to Miss Aubrey. Miss Amy owes you cookies. Um, it didn't happen, but I, Miss Amy owes you cookies, Miss Aubrey, I will get to it. It may be for, you know, a half birthday. <laughs> but cookies will happen eventually. Oh, there, Mr. Chase. I forgot Mr. Chase is in the car. Grammy and Pop Pop are in Ohio to visit. I'm headed to a wedding. Hello, Mr. Chase. Now, the last thing I have to show you is going to be Christmas. So if you don't want to see it, just plug your ears. All right, I'm going to come in the office because it's still back in the office. So we're going to get mom to turn the volume down so that you don't hear me in speaker. 
All right, so the last thing in fabric, and then I'm gonna talk a little bit about Wander Lane since I'm back here too, is Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve has arrived. Okay, here he is. Here she is. It is Layla Boutique from Moda. Okay, let me show you what it looks like. So we have polka dot stripes, obviously plaids. This cute little tiny little wreath. Fa la la la. Some more polka dots. Some branches, some florals. And then up here we have bigger florals. In this collection, we have jelly rolls, fat eighth bundles, layer cakes. Uh, let's go over here for a second. We have charm squares, mini charm squares. That's there. There is also a panel. The panel's not quite ready yet, but it, there is a 58 by 73 inch wide panel that will be coming soon. We have a couple of patterns that are, let me just, let me just do this. I'm gonna set you down. No, exactly, it's Christmassy, but not, it's not poinsettias. Like you could um, do a quilt in this, the grays and the browns, that doesn't look overly Christmas. Like for example, this pattern is called dashing. Okay. So I believe it's 32 pieces, 35. Um, oh, the mini charms would make great little drawstring gift bags, but this pattern called dashing, there's 35 prints or 35 bolts of fabric. Um, this is dashing, not at all Christmas doesn't look like Christmas. <laughs> yeah, none of my birth month flower. <laughs> there is this pattern called Good Tidings. Cute little wreaths and flying geese. And then the last one is called Jolly Holiday. Here he is, Santa. Santa is also available in a kit. Okay. So in this kit includes the fabric. No, they're brand new. I literally just took the patterns out of the box. So if you want to find them, you just got to go to the website and go to the what's new section and they're there. Um, this kit is a 77 square quilt. Uh, in the box is the pattern and all the fabrics to complete the top and the binding. And they are up um, online. I have another pattern coming that uses this line to make deer or reindeer. Um, quilt, so that will be uh, coming shortly. He didn't quite make it here um, at the same time. So Christmas Eve has arrived um, <laughs> here in the store. And whether you want to see it or not, it's here. Well, it's still in the office, so really you can't see it. I got to bring, I got to roll it out um, here. We are, I just want to show or talk for a moment, a real, just a moment, that gray hair again. Um, Wander Lane, you may be seeing it up on Facebook and Instagram, and we've had a couple questions about Wander Lane. Hi, Miss Pam. Hi, Miss Mary Beth. Uh, so Wander Lane is a block of the month that we are doing uh, starting in June. Each month, it's all right here. We got we gotta kit it up yet. Each month you will receive. Let me let me show you what you'll have at the end of the year. Okay, June to July, it's 13 months, 12 months of quilt of blocks. The 13th month will be assembly and borders. So this is the quilt, okay, that you will work on throughout the year. This quilt is not machine embroidered. Okay. Now, my, machine, my peeps who have machine embroidery and embroidery software, you could make it machine embroidered. And maybe I will dabble in that and demonstrate it, but don't, don't expect me to do it for every month, okay? I know, it's a lot. Well, it's a lot with Queen of Diamonds, I know. I, I understand it was probably not the best timing for it all, but that's okay. I have some people that aren't gonna hand piece though. So each month you're going to get the fabrics to do 
a house. Okay, the concept is on Wander Lane is you've got ever a different house for a different to match a different season all living on Wander Lane. You'll also receive the fabrics to make three pieced blocks that will go into this entire border. Now, what's best, what's the best part here about the applique blocks, okay? They are fusible applique. They are already cut and fused for you. There is no tracing. There is no cutting, okay? So I have all the blocks are pre-cut and ready for you to just, if some, like these two are together, um, snip apart and you just fuse it on, okay? So that takes half of the work right there out of fusible applique or machine applique uh, projects is because they're already traced and cut. You don't have to worry about it. So every month, I will do a video education tutorial, tips, tricks, answer questions, all that thing. I'm the one that will be doing those videos. They are not coming from anybody else. They are with me. <laughs> so it is, we will walk through the steps, the tips, the tricks, all of that for the block. You will also receive all the buttons for the block because there are some embellishing but buttons for it as well. You also, this is your pattern booklet. So not only are you getting the pattern to do the block and the three pieces, but you're also getting the pattern booklet to complete all the extra things that are in there if you so choose to make more. We have all the fabrics and everything to do that. So if you really like something, like for example, for me, in the July, which is Liberty Heights, I absolutely love this little throw pillow. And I absolutely love that little um, mini mat that says home. I don't know. There's something about it. I absolutely love it. So I'd probably, out of this pattern, not only make the pieces for the block of the month, but also make some of the extra projects with back quarters, scraps, things along that lines. So yes, you are going to get education with this every month. It will be up on video form on YouTube. Uh, we will be able to get just the books. Um, right the second they're here for the block of the month, um, but I will be getting more in uh, for once we launch it for those that maybe want to do the side projects and not so much the quilt project that's in it because it's from Nancy Halverson. She's one of my favorites. I love Nancy. Um, that's there. So yes. And all the buttons are, they're hand dyed from just another button company, not just hand dyed, but also handmade. They're polymer clay buttons. So they are little tiny cute things um, that are in there. So, and you're getting the buttons to do all the projects. So even if some of the buttons that are here um, may not be used in the quilt block, but you've gotten the buttons. So it's $54.99 a month, okay? Um, for the 13 months that gets you everything to complete your quilt top, your binding, your buttons, your pre-cut fused applique piece, your patterns. No backing, just borders, binding, um, and all your laser cut buttons, floss, anything along that lines that is uh, used. And if you're not local, it shipping um, is there as well. So that's on Wander Lane uh, to start in June. I don't have a definite date, but hopefully we have that all finished. We will be starting with the March block. So we are not starting with June because the second half of Wander Lane uses a different fabric collection, which has not released yet. So we have to start with where the first fabric collection that was created for this was, was here. So we're starting with March and we'll work forward. So we'll start with Shamrock Ridge, will be the first block that we make out of that. And look, you're gonna be ahead of the game and ready for next St. Patrick's Day. <laughs> All right, well, that's what I have for you today. Um, it's been, like I said, it's been a crazy Friday. Um, do I have any questions, comments, concerns from the audience that you would like me to answer? Uh, if you have, um, let's see here. See you in the morning. I hope we are here all day tomorrow, 9.30 to 3. 
Uh, and we hope to see you here in the store sometime or here next Friday. Uh, don't have any concerns about Queen of Diamond. I don't have any openings for tomorrow. Um, cork. Uh, cork, yes and no, cork has come in. So I got in some rolls of cork. Uh, may not be what you're looking for, but I didn't get the... Um, it in yet, so Ms. Sheila, when I get the box open, I will send you a picture of the three pieces of cork that came, um, but they're not they're not up yet. Uh, <laughs> yes, don't go breaking don't go breaking any more machines, Dan and Aaron. I, I won't be able to put the two of you together anymore. So, all right, everybody, have a great weekend, and I will see you all here soon. Thanks so much for hanging out tonight. <laughs>